welcome to today's discussion today we are going to look at the extraction of metals specifically the extraction of lead metal before we look at the given question let us look at the short description on how lead metal is extracted the metal we are talking about is lead metal and lead metal is a metal that lies in the middle of the reactivity series and metals that lie in the middle of the reactivity series are extracted using reduction method so the method of extraction is reduction under reduction we use reducing agents and in this case we can either use coke which is carbon or we use carbon to oxide which is the main reducing agent under the extraction of metals number two we look at the chief o for the extraction of lead metal and the chief o for the extraction of lead metal is galena whose formula is p b s we also have other alternative ores that is other alternative ores one in the cases where we don't have the chief o we can use cerusite which is a lead carbonate we can also use angosite which is lead sulfate the extraction of lead metal is done in two major steps that is number one we take the lead sulfide we burn it in air remember lead in air will give us lead to oxide which is a solid and of course sulfur in air will give us sulfur for oxide which is a gas we balance the equation by writing two behind sulfur for oxide two behind lead to oxide three behind oxygen and two behind galena or lead to sulfide step two we take the lead to oxide which is a solid we reduce it by either cork and if we reduce it by cork you get lead metal and carbon to oxide which is a gas or we can also take the lead to oxide solid we reduce it by the main reducing agent which is which is carbon to oxide and uh, this reaction produces lead metal plus carbon for oxide which is a gas that is how lead metal is extracted by use of reduction method so let us go through the question that we have the question we have reads the diagram below is a flowchart for the extraction of lead metal study it and answer the questions that follow we have galena being taken into the roasting furnace to react with air let us see what the reaction in the roasting furnace produces so let us look at the solution to this question we have uh, galena being roasted in air the reaction here produces lead to oxide a solid and sulfur for oxide which is a gas we balance the equation by writing two behind sulfur for oxide two behind lead to oxide three behind oxygen and two behind lead to sulfide or galena then from the roasting furnace 
We take the lead 2 oxide into the smelting furnace where coke is added. We have iron. We also have limestone. These are the three materials added. We have iron. We have calcium carbonate. We also have coke. So let us begin with the iron that is added into the smelting furnace. The purpose of iron is to remove or reduce any unreacted lead sulfide. And in this case, we take the iron metal plus lead sulfide, a solid. Iron takes sulfur so that we have iron 2 sulfide, which is a solid, plus lead metal, which is also a solid. We also have calcium carbonate. Calcium carbonate decomposes into into calcium oxide and carbon four oxide, which is a gas. The calcium oxide reacts with the ethyl impurities, which is mainly silica to form what we call calcium silicate which is commonly known as a slug we also have uh, carbon the purpose of carbon is to reduce the metal oxide produced from the roasting furnace into lead metal and of course, carbon 2 oxide is produced, which is a gas. So let us go through the questions and see what we were supposed to do. Part A, write down the formula of the major component of galena. And the major component of galena is lead sulfide. That is the formula of galena. B, Write the equation for the reaction that takes place in the roasting furnace. In the roasting furnace is where we have lead sulfide being burnt in air to give us lead 2 oxide plus sulfur 4 oxide which is a gas. We have also done this part by balancing the equation up there. C, identify gas T, and gas T is carbon 2 oxide. Thank you for watching, and welcome to this channel. And in case you are watching this channel for the first time, kindly take one second and click that subscribe button.